the one thing that's really unique about this DVD is you have five world-class drummers all on one project, which I don't think has ever really happened in this kind of format. I thought the chances were pretty slim to pull this off. But when I made the calls and they all said yes, I was pretty blown away, especially getting these five great drummers. Gary Novak, Terry Bozio, Taylor Hawkins, Simon Phillips, Jimmy Chamberlain, Billy Muller on guitar and bass, Tim Landers on bass. I'm Gannon. This whole project has been a dream. The interesting thing in th with this whole group is that everybody's a drummer. You know, Billy Moeller's a drummer. Tim Lanners can play drums. I can play drums a little bit. You know, be t and then obviously the drummers play drums. So we're all like rhythmically sound, you know. We, we understand each other, we can communicate with each other. All the drummers are composers too, which makes it great because they can connect with you with your music. You know, it's like Terry Bozio is a composer. He composes for orchestra. He just composes on drums alone, you know, with all his toms and stuff. So when he interacts with you, it's like he thinks as a composer would. You know, Simon Phillips is a composer. He's had his own band for years. Uh, I know Gary's a composer. Taylor's obviously a composer. We've been touring for the last four years on his music. And Jimmy also writes as well. So it's funny because all those drummers compose so when they play when you're playing with somebody who has that background they really understand how to interact with you and understand how a song is shaped and and how they can complement the material i think what's going to be educational for drummers is that you have five drummers playing on one song which is not from here and all their different approaches and then on Dropout, you have two drummers, Taylor Hawkins and Simon Phillips, and you'll see their radical approaches on it. And then you'll see uh, on the song Get On With It, you have Jimmy Chamberlain and Gary Novak, and they have also different approaches. So I think that'll be great for drummers to see how each drummer changes the groove or what he does on the song that makes it different. Mm -hmm. 